There's a skeleton out there somewhere. Busy talking away and not even paying attention to what's going on. Let's see if we can... Where's he at? Oh, I see you. Hello everybody and welcome back to Vanilla Plus. We're here and we're standing outside the mines because I... I'm getting ready to go mining. Um, kind of missed last week. I've been having allergies, which has been having a causing throat irritation, which left me not really wanting to speak more than necessary. But today I thought I'd do some mining because I don't have very many resources. Um, and I don't think I've shown you guys the mine so far. I don't know. I don't remember if I showed you. I kind of made a nice staircase going down. Um, widened up this part. Still haven't lit up all that down there, but it is what it is. It's a nice efficient way to get down. It's a little curvy and twisty here and there, but it's nice and wide open and fairly friendly. Um, we don't have much iron left. I think I have six pieces of iron. I have some gold and some lapis, but those aren't really very useful. Um, and I keep going through um, all my other tools. So that will come down, do some mining, do a little chat maybe. Um, maybe just do some speed mining if I don't feel like talking very much. Um, oh, excuse me, I'm a little bit tired. Um, and also, we don't have a whole lot of coal. We've got maybe 40 coal at home. But I started setting up a little strip mine. Just check down here and we've got it eh, down quite a bit of ways um that's about it really i only i only did down the one one strip okay so it's not a very big strip mine no wonder we don't have any resources but we don't have any diamonds and we don't have much of anything else i mean like i said we have some redstone which i have no use for at the moment and we have some some uh, lapis, but you know, diamonds would be nice. That would make my tools last a lot longer. Because I keep going through these iron picks and stuff like the butter and the shovels, too. Um, and I like to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I like to put a torch about every eight spaces. And usually I count, I uh, mine out four at a time and then four at a time, and then it's easy to keep track of. Just like that. And then we'll go out for more. Anyway, so I hope you guys didn't miss me too much. Um, um, I'm sorry I was gone last week. But like I said, you know, my throat gets sore and itchy and scratchy and I just don't feel like talking more than I have to and I have to talk during my day job. So, yeah, when I get home, I just want to sit and be quiet and relax. Hey, we got some iron. Go ahead and put a torch down there. Okay, let's get some more iron. Hopefully we can get some diamonds. We are on level 11. Um, come here, you. There we go. Then we'll fill that back in. I want to say thank you to Tova um, for the suggestion on using uh, the sandy brick slabs instead of stairs. Um, I'm not sure about in front of the houses. I just put, um, before I started the episode, I ran around because I had some stairs and I put them in front of the houses and they look okay. Um, the problem with putting them in front of the house, slabs in front of the houses is you can see the foundation block um, behind the stairs. So that might not work, but we could use it on the paths instead of stairs. That is a, definitely a much better idea. Um, I think paths look better with slabs because it looks a little more like a smoother transition. Um, but yeah. So I hope everybody is doing well. Um, man, there's just like nothing down here. 
Oh well. We just started. And I'm sure this isn't the most effective um, branch mining. I mean, it is the most common. That's cobblestone. Let's investigate. Um, let me check my sounds. My sounds seem really off today. Hostile, hostile mobs. Just make sure if this is a mobs, if this is a a dungeon or a spawner, I want to be able to hear it. Oh uh, no, this is just cobble from. Okay. I got it. That was just a pocket of something I mined from the other side. It's like there's no mossy cobble here, so I don't think it's a dungeon. Nope, it's just the remains of a pocket I am um, dug from the other side. No biggie. Now my count is off. One, two, three, four. Okay. Um. Maybe you should make my spaces farther apart. How many did I, did I make them? I thought I made them three apart. Maybe I only made them two. can never remember. Some people say three spaces apart. Some people, I've always thought it was two. I did only make them two. Let's make them three apart. From now on, fill that like that. Let's go chuck that in the furnace. Um, so yes, where was I? So, um, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna dig for a little while because I have nothing else to talk about because I forgot what I was talking about. Um, and then also I picked up a tip from the guys who do MHC um, to go three. And I think that's a good idea because that really feels like you know, three extra blocks that could potentially have um, ores in it. So I'm going to keep going along here for a little while. I'll probably dig out a couple ton more tunnels and I will come back if anything exciting happens. Alright, so that last, I decided to make a stone pick and I used that all up. I only got one more tunnel done, but uh, you know, it's a little bit more progress. Um, how much iron did we end up getting? We got nine altogether. We'll go ahead and take that up. I haven't put a chest down here, but eh. I'll save my iron pickaxe because I didn't really get enough iron to make more. Um, so I did get a good suggestion, and I'm sorry, I don't remember who it was um, that suggested it. Um, but to make a fishing farm, like an AFK fishing farm, and then like an, a little fishing pond. And that is something I talked about doing uh, way back, way back, like it was a long time ago. But it feels like a long time ago. When I started this series, um, I talked about making an AFK fishing farm out of one of the nearby huts. But this person suggested putting it um, where the cactus was out by the cow and mm, pig tent pens. Ow. Okay, bow. There's a skeleton out there somewhere. Busy talking away and not even paying attention to what's going on. Let's see if we can... Where's he at? Oh, I see you. I, ow, how come you can see me, get me, and I can't get you? Oh, come on. There we go. Come on, game, stop lagging. Ow! <sighs> ow. Okay, let's just leave him alone. Get out of here. I don't want to fight him. Is it nighttime out? 
Oh, no, no. No. All right. The sun is rising, so it is morning. Good. We should have been far enough away that the villagers are safe, but... I don't hear any zombie apocalypse going on, so we should be fine. I also put down, this isn't regular grass. You can see uh, by the whale at the top, it's topiary grass. So that's kind of a little greenery I put there, and then I put down this water tank, which actually joins into a multi-block structure, which looks kind of cool. So they, those can all hold water, maybe for a little trough, maybe, I don't know we'll, what we'll do with it. So everybody seems to be hanging out in this house now. I don't know what I did differently, and I forgot to close the door on my house. But yes, so I think I was smelting up a little bit of iron before I left. Yes. And then we'll just throw in some more, like all of it for now, and plop. Hello? What? That was weird. Okay, I was trying to put the coal in there. There we go. I don't know what I hit, but apparently whatever it was, it didn't, didn't like it. So I have five in there, that's six. So I have 11, um, and then I've got 60 coal now, and more redstone. All right, so the other thing I was working on, I've got some sandstone on me. That's right, I was working on the fence a little bit. I extended it just a little bit, and um, one of the main reasons I decided I needed more iron is because my axes are about gone, but maybe I could do a stone axe. I mean, like, this is almost gone. I could combine those two together and make that a little bit better. My shovel's almost gone. Just everything is falling apart. I go through these tools so crazy. I really need diamond tools. Or at least something that lasts much longer. But I don't know what it is yet. Um, and I really, really, really wish I didn't have the lag still. But, you know, I do. And it, it, I live with it. It's, it is what it is. Okay, we've got a ton of cobblestone. Okay, jungle wood. Jungle wood. There we go, 44. Um, I didn't want all of it, but maybe I do. Maybe I do want all of it. Let's see what we have for jungle wood in here. That's not jungle wood. Uh, I don't see any jungle wood in here. Okay, well, so we need some more jungle fences for the barrier, so I guess we'll make some of those. And I don't remember the recipe for fences. I think it's the old stick recipe, but we'll find out in a second. No, okay. So that's not the recipe for fences. Now, is this the recipe for a fence or for a gate? I forget. That is a gate, so it's the other way around. Okay. Sticks in the middle. Planks on the sides. Got it. Maha, like so. Okay. So let's make up a bunch of those. Come on, there we go. Okay, well, that's not a whole lot, but it's a few. This guy's running around in circles. Lovely. Okay, so let's see how far I got, because I can't remember. 
I don't know why I wanted to build in a village and put up with all the pesky villagers. I forget now. Maybe I'll just get rid of the villagers and keep the village. I mean, I always wanted to work with villagers, but they're so noisy and annoying. And it's like nice to trade with them, maybe, but stop missing one there. But I don't know. They're 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 pretty darn stupid. Okay, so that's as far as I got. So we're gonna one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and get the sandstone. One, two. And I'll fill in the trench later. How do I want to do this? I don't know. We could actually, actually, I didn't bring my shovel, but that's okay. I'll take these two down. Well, actually, we wanted to keep one, but that's okay. Eh. Eh. Okay. And then since I forgot my shovel, I guess I will dig this up by hand. Eh. Digging my torch is so slow. I'm sorry I'm not upbeat and energetic for you guys. Like I said, it's just, it's been, I, I guess I haven't said, but it's been kind of a long week. I'm doing lots of stuff in personal life and anyway, yeah. And with the allergies I'm dealing with, it's just, I don't have my energy back yet. But I hope to have it back soon. Please don't leave me. I need you. Okay, that didn't go very far, but that's looking, uh, coming along nicely. Um, I think that's going to be very nice indeed, and we'll come back, use some of this sand we dug up to start filling in, um, some of the trench that we dug up at the beginning, because it's kind of an eyesore now. I mean, this part isn't so bad, but it's like, really? Hello? There we go. So I'm going to fill this in, and I will be back shortly with another project. Alright guys, the last project I want to do today is... The house that was blown up by a creeper a long, long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. See, these are all the houses with the sandy brick stairs. Not too bad in the little topi area. I think put flowers in there. It's gonna look lovely. I promise you, it'll look gorgeous. Anyway, so a long time ago, there was this house over here that got blown up by a creeper. And I thought today we would put a door on it. There we go! It's beautiful. Just kidding. Just kidding. Got a little energy back. We're actually going to fix it up here. We're going to turn it into a storage building. Ooh. Basically, we're just going to turn it into a house again for now. Um, and then we'll make storage out of it. Yes, we will. Um, and I'll probably have to fix it up later. And, you know, just like I'm doing all the buildings, making them look better new and improved and spiffy and so on and so forth. This one I'm going to do the same thing with. I even brought some glass. Go bam. Bam. And oh, there's already the torch in here. Yay! And then we'll put another torch. Oh, we haven't filled in that part yet. Oopsie! Guess we should come outside and fill that part out. Uh-huh. Oh, I only got one more sandstone left on me. Well, that's not going to help very much, is it? Um, not really. Well, in that case, you know what? It, it just, it is what it is. Ta-da! <laughs> it is missing a bit. Um, 
we'll place this one. Can we place this one right here? Right there? Right, right, right there? No. Right there? Right there? No, <laughs> not there. All right, well, I guess that'll, that, that, that's whatever it is. Okay, and I'm gonna make, a, I'm gonna have to make this more accessible. I don't even know if we've ever been in this house. Hello? Have we been in this house? Oh, oh look at stone slabs. Stone slabs and a garden. Man, we should have moved in here, but it's right on the edge of the forest and probably attract all the zombies and skeletors. And their zombies and skeletons and, you know, all the bad guys. And it's not very big, but my house isn't very big either. Anyway, I guess that's going to do it for today. Um, my voice is starting to feel a little worn out. I might want to leave that one just for safety barrier. Don't go straight out the door. But yeah, and then in my trench is over here. The well's over there. You guys let me know, do you think there's anything underneath the well? Because there used to be theories long, long ago that there were things under the wells. And there's a pear tree right there. We found ours way over yonder. Anyway, let me know if you think there's anything underneath the well. And otherwise, I think... You know, I'll just talk to you next time. Is that actually, hold on, is that just one saguaro cactus that's got many, many, many arms? <gasps> I love it. Maybe, whoop. Why don't they all look like that? Like, did that one, hmm. Hmm. Yes, we were gonna, we were gonna science a, sag a sag saguaro cactus one of these days. See if I chop it down to one block if it's going to grow. And we haven't ever done that, I don't think. So now is the time, because I'm thinking about it and I didn't really want to say goodbye yet, because I feel like I, with all the speed building and cutaways, this is probably a very short episode. I'm going to punch you off right there. Now I will let you grow. And this is where they wanted the um, fishing area, so that'll be nice. Um, ow. It's still a cactus, apparently, so you take d damage. These guys? Do I don't, I don't remember. Do I take damage from these? No, apparently not. But they give me cactus fruit. Haha! -ha, I love cactus fruit. Num 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 num. Can I eat it, actually? Nope, but I planted it on accident. Alright. Nope, can't eat yet. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I've been Dragon Feathers. Tune in. Hopefully this will continue and I will feel better and you guys will give me lots of feedback and make me happy. Anyway, I will see you next week. Bye-bye!